SR-72 is not just a project, but an ambition to create an aircraft that moves several times faster than sound and can cross an ocean in the time ordinary planes are still gathering data. Its concept is a hypersonic reconnaissance platform with a declared speed of over Mach 6 and minimal reaction time. Imagine a vehicle that can simultaneously evade interception and deliver intelligence, or even a strike payload, to places other fighters simply cannot reach. But behind this dream stands a series of serious challenges. First, the engines. Such speeds require hybrid power plants, a combination of a turbojet engine with a ramjet or a rocket booster. All of this operates at the limits of material capabilities. Second, the temperatures. At Mach 6, the airframe heats up to thousands of degrees, so conventional metal would simply melt. New ceramic and composite coatings are needed, and they are only now undergoing testing. Third, controllability. At hypersonic speeds, conventional aerodynamics no longer works. The aircraft must rely on complex control algorithms and entirely new engineering solutions. That is why the SR-72 remains a concept, not a finished combat aircraft, but a direction that opens the door to future technologies. It is more of an experiment than a platform ready for serial use. And although the idea looks extremely attractive, its implementation will require many more years of testing and massive investment. 